if there are any better methods than paying with credit cards then it gotta be reward apps how it works is that when you add a credit card into this reward apps and then make a payment through these apps not only you will earn from your original credit card use where you get your own cashback and miles but you also get additional cashback and miles on top of the credit card rewards so this term is called reward stacking because you get from both the reward apps itself as well as the credit card company and usually these rewards can be utilized on your next purchase or they can be redrawn as cash or mouse depending on the apps itself but you know yang mao chu zai yang shen sang they have to earn money some way right why are they even giving out free money so the business model is that they do earn a referral or commission if you have used their platform to make a purchase on the goods and services that is referred through their platform or they could charge a merchant fee as a payment processor for the merchants who are using their platform for payment and you have more questions or you want to learn more about all these credit card knowledge strategies then head over to our 8000 over members telegram group at honey money sg to join our community right here the first rewards app that i want to introduce is shopback and i believe that shopback is quite familiar to everyone by now there are three main business models of shopback firstly there is the shopback online whereby you have to click a link through shopback to your favorite merchant and then you can earn some additional cashback so before you want to make any purchase online it will be good that you go through shopback and search for that merchant that you want to buy your product from and most importantly clear your shopping cart before you click through shopback otherwise those things that you have added before you click through shopback will not be tracked some popular merchants that you can click through shopback and get additional cashback will be places like booking.com shopee or fair price online the next business of shopback is shopback vouchers whereby you can purchase prepaid gift cards or vouchers and then store them in your account until you want to make a next purchase for example you can get gift cards from online e-commerce stores like q10 lazada shin and even some some fmb outlets who are selling gift cards on shopback and the good thing about shopback vouchers is that when you want to clock a certain minimum spending to hit your promotions for example you want to hit 600 dollars on your uob evo so you don't have any current spend you can just buy a prepaid spend from shopback and it will qualify as an online shopping category the last function of shopback is shopback pay and this is where you can see all these shopback pay qrs in your neighborhood stores and you can even use a link credit card in your shopback app to make payment at this shop back qr merchants the good thing is you can get five percent cashback on your next visit so it does not apply on your current visit you have to make a repeated purchase through the same merchant to get the cashback that you earned earlier and you know a lot of stores they don't accept credit card right but they do accept shop back pay qr so that's where shop back pay is really useful because you can make a spend on your credit card right now through shop back pay to pay these merchants who do not accept credit cards shop back pay also have a buy now pay later service known as shop back pay later where you will split to three monthly installments with zero interest so it's good for those people who need it but i don't use it how to utilize your shop back pay cashback is that if you want to withdraw you need to have a minimum of ten dollars and you can withdraw it to your PayLah wallet and you will be reflected within a few minutes best cards to be linked with shopback pay will be those credit cards that rewards you for online shopping and for air miles that will be dbs women's world mastercard city rewards or hsbc fair evolution then for cashback credit cards it will be uob evo dbs Fresh, or city smrt and if you are a new user to shopback you can use my referral code down below to get five dollars as a new sign up but you know what's good for a new sign up as well it will be a reward from my sponsor welcome to the month of august which is also singapore's birthday month celebrating its 58th national day to rejoice this special occasion weibo has simplified its requirements for the welcome offers now you just need to do one simple step which is fund at least 300 singapore dollars into your weibo account and you can get one lucky draw chance where you can win from one of the following prices which is 58 us dollars or 580 us dollars worth of tesla shares or you may win 8 18 or 28 trading vouchers worth 10 us dollars each you see the thing about this promotion is that there is no buy trade required there is no options trade required really nothing so it's really one of the best time to sign up for a weibo account without all the complicated terms and conditions so use my referral link down below or scan the qr code right here to get your weibo account for this national day the next rewards app will be faith 
and Faith will have two business models as well, namely the Faith Deals and the Faith Pay. Faith Deals is what Faith started with. They offer like discounted vouchers to beauty and massage places, restaurants, hotel stays, travel destinations, and interesting activities that you can explore. Sometimes you may get a really good discount, like you can see all these hotel buffets and F&B restaurants offering very good offers that you may not even heard of, and you can get to try new experiences with their activities. So Faith Deal is a very simple concept you just buy the discounted voucher, make a reservation at your merchant and then show up, allow the merchant to just swipe or scan your voucher to redeem it and you're good to go. No cash needed. The other business of Faith is Faith Pay and that's where you can get from 0 to 5% cashback on your next visit as well. Similar to Shopback Pay, it is a return cashback model as well. So that's when if you scan the Faith Pay QR code and maybe you get like $5 cashback, but you cannot utilize for this visit or withdraw it. You can only spend it on your next visit. So it kind of rewards those people who are loyal customers and visit the same store for repeated purchases. But ultimately, using Faith Pay is still better than using cash because there are two credit cards that I would recommend for Faith. And for miles, that will be City Rewards credit card where you can get 4 miles per dollar or 10x reward points. And then for cashback, you can look at OCBC Frank, which also specifically rewards cashback for Faith as well. But if you want to compare Shopback Pay versus Faith Pay, I would say Shopback Pay is better because Shopback do accept much more credit card for rewards, whereas Faith Pay is only limited to these few credit cards. The last rewards app will be good for mile chasers, and that is the Chris Plus app. For Chris Plus, I believe it's a combination between Shopback Pay and Faith plus a little customization on the mouse rewards part because you can buy discounted merchant deals just like you do on Faith. You can also make payments through the Chris Plus app to Chris Plus partners using either credit cards or Chris Pay mouse. And that's very creative, right? Using your Air Mouse rewards to make payment. Now you can monetize it. But of course, it's not at a good rate. It's at a discounted haircut rate. And similar to Shopback or Faith, you do get rewards when you make payment to their Chris Plus partners, but you don't get it in cash, you get it in miles. For example, in the recent promotion, Chris Plus do offer 25% miles back when you make payment using their miles instead of credit card. So what it means is that if you want to pay $100, you get 25% in Chris Pay miles back. And if you look at some of these Chris Pay deals, they can offer up to 50% discounted during the promotion period. But that is a seasonal offer. How about a recurring offer? Because if you look at the MasterCard challenge, Chris Plus usually offers a cash discount if you make a minimum spend using a MasterCard. So it can be a good 15-20% to 20 discount if you use a link MasterCard. So what are the best credit cards to use with Chris Plus? I would say if you're a mouse chaser, you can look at DBS Women's World MasterCard, HSBC Revolution, and UOB Ladies if you choose your category as dining and you're spending at a dining merchant. How about City Rewards for Chris Plus? I think you need to pair it up with the Amaze, otherwise it will not be qualified because Amaze will convert that transaction to an online spend which makes it eligible, whereas City Rewards itself will not be rewarded because it's a mobile wallet transaction through Chris Plus. Now if you're a cashback user, then just stick to the normal cashback credit cards like UOB Evo or DBS Leapfresh and you should be good. But Take note that because they are Visa credit cards, they are not eligible for the MasterCard challenge. And all this is just a tip of the iceberg of what I introduced in Chris Plus because I do have a specific video for Chris Plus right here where I go through the real benefits.